And Bob, as they come toward us, what we aren't seeing is these big skits that they do on New Year's Day. Tell the viewers why we aren't seeing that and, and uh, what we are seeing. Well, you're seeing a summer mummers parade, right. which is a it's whole a short different and shortened parade. They right. want the mayor wants to keep this parade moving, entertaining, fun, and Fourth of July, red, white, and blue summer. The parade normally would consist of floats that range up to 50 feet wide, right. 16 feet to 20 feet high, lots of marshals carrying props, and a four-minute presentation, four-minute, 30-second presentation. Tonight, we're moving. We're moving down Market Street. We're doing it in great time. We're right on schedule. And uh, it's fun to see Egypt come to Market Street. The mummies <laughs> have never looked better with their parasol. <laughs> oh, I bet they're hot. And they're backed up by the Furco String Band. Ah, one of the classics in our parade. They, they were second last year? They were second last year. The captain was fourth. They have 16 first prize to their record. They've been around since 1922. Captain Bill Speziel Jr. has been with Perka for 25 years, 15 years as captain. He got fourth this year. One of the gentlemen of the string band group, a strutter with a touch of class. Now, Bob, you're not doing any consulting for Furco, are you? Just, uh, <laughs> just to make sure there's no conflict here. Actually, I, Bob, you are working with 11 fancy brigades and seven string bands this year alone, coming up with ideas and costumes. That must be a heck of a lot of thinking going on. You probably wake up in the middle of the night thinking about what kind of costumes you're going to put these folks in. Well, it's called Midnight Men. <laughs> All right, here we go. Let's take a listen. Furco string band, one of the best. of a down-on-the-farm theme. Yes, <laughs> backyard <this> boogie. <laughs> and I like the scarecrow. They had scarecrows, <laughs> they had farmers. I'm, I'm, again, I'm, I'm missing the horse. Two people in that horse. It's not on Broad Street, uh, <laughs> actually on Market Street. Even I keep referring it to Broad Street. Yeah, they look kind of alike, right? That's Furco. And we're going to take a short break, and we're going to be back